The case spanned two years. The trial took seven weeks. The result, Johnson & Johnson ordered to pay $572 million for its role in Oklahoma's opioid crisis. In his decision, Cleveland County District Judge Thad Balkman cited what he called the drug giant's false and misleading marketing of opioids. Oklahoma Attorney General Mike Hunter called Johnson & Johnson the kingpin behind the nation's opioid crisis. Hunter's team of 13 attorneys described the trial as taking on the lion. We have proven that Johnson & Johnson built its billion-dollar brand out of greed and on the backs of pain and suffering of innocent people. Oklahoma is one of dozens of states suing opioid drug makers. This was the first state case to reach trial. Hunter hopes it will help other states be successful. But an attorney for Johnson & Johnson described the judge's decision as flawed. Johnson & Johnson did not cause the opioid abuse crisis here in Oklahoma or anywhere in this country. I'm Mandy Gaither reporting.